The House is set to vote today on that two-year bipartisan budget deal we've been hearing about. Now, the deal includes $85 billion in spending cuts. It is expected to get a significant amount of GOP support, despite some opposition from ultra-conservatives. The Senate is expected to vote on it next week, and President Obama said he will sign it. Tennessee Senator Lamar Alexander fires his chief of staff after the staffer's home was searched in connection with a child porn investigation. Ryan Loscarn has been Alexander's chief of staff for the past two years. Alexander first announced yesterday that Loscarn had been placed on administrative leave. He then later released a statement announcing Loscarn, Loscarn excuse me, had been let go. This story is crazy. An entire community was completely excluded from one of the biggest events in recent history after it turns out the sign language interpreter during Nelson Mandela's memorial service was nothing but a fake. The South African government has since been inundated by members of the deaf community calling for an investigation into what the hell happened and how the bozo has been allowed to sign at major events for quite some time. The government says they are looking into it.